My name's Cass, I am a primary school teacher. I work in regional Victoria at the moment with primary school aged children and I just love teaching. I've always wanted to teach and I'm really happy doing what I'm doing. I would love to see mental health and wellbeing prioritised up there with reading, writing. I think it is just as important as, as anything else at school. And I think sadly, because we are such a results driven um, society, especially at a few schools that I've been at, they tend to scrap those things on the side because they're not contributing to academic outcomes. But again, you can't have those fantastic academic outcomes unless you have optimal mental health. I start my day most days asking the children what they're grateful for or something great that's happened to them or on the other side, you know, what something happened, what has happened this week that wasn't so good, let's talk about it, let's try to overcome it and, and discuss it. And I do meditation every day after lunch, it's good for the kids, but also I find I'm really dependent on it too now. If I'm reliant on it in a positive way, I'd like to think that my kids could be too and, and that is ultimately my job is to provide students with all of the resources that I can to ensure that they become healthy adults who can live productive lives. I think that this is such a worthy cause to be a part of and to be involved in. Everyone is affected by mental health. It's not, you know, a quarter of the population or anything. It's every single human being. And the statistics show that targeting five to 12 year olds is going to help us in the future to try to create a healthy generation. And that's exactly where I am. I think that creating that excitement with other teaching professionals to implement it into schools and embed it in our education practice will just be phenomenal and I can't wait to see how what we're doing will help shape the future. I think that's really exciting. Mm -hmm.